All right, thanks a lot, Brandon. Right now, live pictures from the Venezuelan Colombian border and the National Guard launching tear gas at residents who are trying to get humanitarian aid past metal barricades. We've seen fires there this morning, lots happening on that border. All of this happening as President Nicolas Maduro prepares to close the border indefinitely. Local 10's Trent Kelly joins us live from the newsroom now with the latest developments this morning. Fast and furious, right, Trent? Yeah, Nikki Todd, some tense moments that we're already seeing there this morning with the country's interim president now vowing to make sure that aid makes it through the blocked border today. That move coming just a day after thousands of people turned out for a relief concert. They were hoping to send a massive message last night to Maduro. New video showing clashes continuing in Venezuela today. Protesters sent scrambling as the Venezuelan military fired off tear gas along the Colombian border. This cell phone video appearing to show three Maduro soldiers defecting. The tense moments coming just hours after a crowd of nearly 300,000 gathered for a star-studded relief concert in Cucuta, Colombia on Friday. Their goal, to increase pressure on Maduro, who continues to block shipments of aid. Venezuela's interim president, Juan Guaido, risking his own arrest to make an appearance. We need medicine, we need food. Uh, in Venezuela, it's terrible what is happening right now. A much different scene on the other side of the border, where Maduro put on his own rival concert, calling it Hands Off Venezuela. The event attended by just a few hundred people. Support also on display in South Florida, where hundreds gathered in Miami to remember the lives that have already been lost. This is the time where we bend our knees and we ask God, please, you have to do this. And this is when we say, you know, God will make a way. And guys, let's go ahead and go back to some of those live pictures coming to us from the border there uh, along Venezuela. Just a short time ago, uh, we saw what appeared to be more tear gas that was fired there into the crowd. We've been seeing those protesters trying to remove some of the barriers that have been set up there, trying to clear the path for that aid to enter later today. Uh, as you can imagine, those crowds are expected to build all throughout the day. In the meantime, we also know that Nicolas Maduro is scheduled to hold his own rally in just a couple of hours in Caracas. He's expected to, to address his people as well. well. We will be keeping a close eye on that as we try to see if he finally caves in and lets that aid enter his country. Nikki Todd, we'll go ahead and send it back to you.